When the Saints play the Panthers on Sunday, they're going to beat them. I've got the Saints beating the Panthers 40 to 10. The Saints will dominate the Panthers from start to finish. Drew Brees will have a great game. He'll probably throw for over 300 yards. He'll probably have about four or five touchdowns. Alvin Kamara will do his thing out there. He'll probably have a touchdown or two. He will run the ball all over that Panthers defense as well as catching the ball out of the backfield. So he's going to cause headaches for that Carolina Panthers defense. Michael Thomas will get into the act. Last week against the Titans, he broke Marvin Harrison's all-time receptions record. So he's going to add to that record. He'll probably have 10 catches for 120 yards and a touchdown or two. So he'll do his thing. Jared Cook will do his thing out there too. Tyson Hill, he'll be running over that Panthers defense. He might even throw a pass or two. So everyone will get into the act. The Saints defense will hold down the Carolina Panthers offense. So I expect Jordan to have a great game. Lattimore will do his thing. Whoever's playing for the Panthers, for the Saints defense, they're just going to dominate the Panthers offense. So it doesn't matter who's playing at quarterback. Whether it's Kyle Allen or Will Greer or whomever, it doesn't matter. They're not going to do much against that Saints defense. This team is prime and ready to go. They're going to make a strong statement on Sunday. They're going to let the world know that they are for real. They're going to put a football beat down on the Carolina Panthers. It's not going to be close. So like I said, I've got the Saints beating the Panthers 40 to 10. And as we know, the Panthers have pretty much melded in. They let go of Ron Rivera and Perry Fuel, I believe his name is. He's the interim head coach. So, this, so the Panthers are looking forward to next season. I don't think they're going to be thinking much about this game. But hey, who knows? They're both NFC rivals. So maybe the Panthers might put forth a little bit more effort because it's a divisional game. But it's not going to be enough. I just, mentally, I don't think that they're thinking about winning. I think they're more thinking about the future and who the next head coach is going to be. So their mind is not really going to be focused on this game as it should be. I just think there are too many distractions going on there, which would make it easier for the Saints to beat them. So I've got the Saints dominating Panthers on Sunday. It's just going to be a great game. Offensively, they're going to do their thing. And... As we know, Sean Payton is going to have this team ready to play. He always has the Saints ready to play. The Saints always bring their A game and not their OK game. And we will see that on Sunday. So after this game, the Saints will be 13-3. and three. They're definitely going to make it to the playoffs. And they're going to march all the way on down to the Super Bowl. We'll be seeing them playing in Miami over there. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. You should definitely subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Just press that subscribe button below this video. Because I'll be putting out more content like this and I wouldn't want you to miss out on any of it. So, you should definitely, definitely, definitely subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope that all of you have a blessed, wonderful, day.